Hi guys, so we're here this afternoon and we spent all morning kind of in the apartment because as you can see it is kind of rainy and cold so I've dragged Rum down to a place called Boston it's right near the subway line um, that is near our apartment and they do like the traditional style um, Japanese strawberry shortcake thingies and so we got a couple of slices look at this adorable little box whoa and look it even comes they put a little like ice pack in there to make sure your cake stays nice and cold which is amazing oh my god honestly and it's got like a little plastic bit and we don't have any forks or anything so I'm just going to attempt to like bite this okay oh my god it is so good like layers of sponge cake cream strawberries and like this gelatiny um, icing amazing so what do you think of the cake oh it's so good um, combination of it being nice and cold, but not like frozen cold. The the cakey bits are so f fluffy and nice, and the cream is so sweet, and just a tiny bit of tartness from the strawberries is so good. So four dollars for some of this. Yeah. I got this stuff. I was after a coffee, um, but I had this thing on the top. So I assume it's a toy of some sort, so naturally I had to buy it. It does look a bit suspicious, but let's go and have a look what it is. I can figure out how to open it. What is that? A little street vendor dude thing. I'm gonna call him Harry. So apparently um, he's a soup sitter. He sits on your soup for some reason. Um, but there is... Another guy, which I want, he's a key holder down there. But there's an, also a guy that holds USB cables and uh, an earphone holder guy. So I'm really going to have to drink a lot of coffee. Any excuse will do for coffee. Yum. Okay, so we're here in Mos Burger. I got this delicious looking Mexican flatbread type thing. It's got corn chips on it and lettuce and tomato and some beef, I think, and some sort of deli delicious sauce. And I got random burger on the menu that I haven't had. Um, I think it's Thousand Island dressing and you can see what all the rest is. And I also got onion rings, which I didn't realize is just two onion rings with chips. Oh, it's great. So it's, I'm guessing this is just a standard Mos Burger type thing with um, Thousand Island dressing, but it is so good. I'm such a big fan of their uh, meat patties. Um, I could just eat them by themselves constantly. They are so yum. So what's the verdict? Mm, really good. The meat's a little bit spicy. Um, but only like a tiny bit because here in Japan spicy things tend to be not as spicy as home um, And just very like traditional Mexican-y kind of spice flavor delicious So we're here in Momogaike Park in the Ebeno area in Osaka. So we're just going to have a look around and maybe find some geocaches if there's any here. here doing some geocaching and there is a magnetic micro somewhere around this area and Grum just spotted some um, cicada shells and was telling me an interesting story. Yeah those little shells um, they contain cicadas obviously um, and southern part of Japan over the last month or so would have been swarming with the stuff they go everywhere kids love grabbing them capturing them putting them in boxes and then letting them go for some reason because that's what kids do um, but yeah just after the whole cicada season happens you find these little shells dotted all around the places and it looks like there's still a bug inside them but they're empty <laughs> my 
second ever cache that I have found. Yay! Normally I give up. So, just open it. It's quite a good little spot because you're actually protected from muggles. Kind of. Yay! Thanks whoever stuck that there. Uh, so anyway, I just thought I would give you a little bit of lesson about this shrine here. So this is Momogayaki Mo Myojin Shrine. Um, and this is actually, the shrine's history is said to be traced all the way back to the era of Shotoku Taishi, some 1400 years ago. How cool is that? The so is having a little bit of a nap right now. I am just watching some YouTube and I'll probably end the vlog today off right here uh, because we will probably not do anything that much more exciting today. So it was very, very humid outside today so we did spend most of it inside um, and it was raining and stuff outside but we had a nice little walk, had amazing cake, had delicious moss burger, went geocaching, uh, yeah! and I'm not sure what we're doing tomorrow um, just yet. It depends on the weather. Um, but yeah, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And as always, if you want to keep in touch with all of our Japan adventures, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye!